Tonight, we know more about why investigators spent all day at a home in Newport News yesterday. Ten of your side obtained court documents showing fire officials looking for a possible drug lab, and they found pipe bombs. And that's not all. Erin Kelly has been going through that paperwork. She joins us now. Erin? Yeah, Nicole, we don't have a lot of details about what investigators were looking for in the first place. Yesterday, they told us someone contacted the Newport News Organized Crime Division about a possibly hazardous material. But tonight, paperwork shows they found things capable of making an explosive device. For more than 12 hours, investigators from Newport News Police and Fire, State Police, and the DEA searched a home on Cary Lake Drive Thursday. Neighbors weren't sure what was going on. It's unusual. I haven't had something like this happen before so close to home, but um, it looked like everything was under control. Nobody was panicking. So Police wouldn't say what kind of hazardous material may have been inside the home, but said they were removing items for testing. Court documents obtained by 10 on your side show the deputy fire marshal was helping search for a possible drug lab, and investigators found two pipe bombs. The documents say they were made of PVC with black powder in them and had the ends capped off and that there was a bag of black powder with them in the upstairs bedroom. According to the paperwork, the garage area had what appeared to be two different labs, which had other materials for making an explosive device. A log of evidence shows investigators recovered more than 50 items, including powders, liquids, and a rocket igniter. The homeowner told us her grandson was an ODU chemistry student who lived with her, but she said Thursday he was out of town and was surprised by all of it. He was the first time he heard about it because he was just knew that all of his and chemicals were okay, legal and okay. And police say there's no threat to the public and they do not have any suspects or warrants for an arrest. They say it's still an active investigation and that it would be inappropriate to discuss any pending charges. Erin Kelly, 10 on your side.